Are you guys ready for this? The Olympics are starting in February. So in honor of that, we are having an Olympic goals challenge here at school. And you get to help your kinder out because part of these goals are going to be for homework. So this video is to explain all about how those goals are going to work. On Monday, your kinder is going to bring home an envelope that looks like this. Everything you need for their goals are inside this envelope. First thing you should pull out is this half sheet that says my weekly Olympic goals. Um, there'll be four goals on there. We'll talk about those at the end of this video. And there's also a suggested homework guide. So, for example, on Mondays, if I were you, I would read your decodable book and study your sight word list and so on and so on. The first goal on your sheet is a sight word list goal. So, you're gonna have a list that looks like this inside your envelope. Your job is to memorize all these words. I would practice them out of order if I were you because sometimes we just memorize the word that comes after a word and if we're really gonna know it, we need to be able to read them in any order. And that's how I will be checking their learning on Fridays. Can they read all 10 of these words out of order? If so, for their next homework, they'll move on to list two. If they don't read them all right, we'll stay on list one until they have all those words down. The next goal is a counting goal. So by the end of kindergarten, they need to be able to count to 100 by ones. Now, if they've already met that goal, we're gonna start learning how to skip count. So by twos, by fives, and so on. So this is something you can practice in the car, at the dinner table, anywhere really. So get to counting, have fun. The third goal we're working on is math fact fluency. And I'm actually using an online program called Extra Math to help us with our fact fluency. So in your envelope, you're gonna find a paper that looks like this, which has all the instructions on how to log into this program. You can use a desktop computer or a tablet or even your cell phone. Um, the app does cost $5. If you do it on your desktop computer though, it's free. So let me know if you don't have access to the internet at home, then I'll get you a set of just paper flashcards to practice with. Either way, practicing over and over is the only way to get better at our math facts. So I'm including that goal for this reason. The last goal is a book goal. So each week they're gonna have a book that looks probably something like this sent home. Um, I posted a video last week about the difference between sight words and CBC words. So if you really wanna help your kinder read this book, I would go back and watch that video. Um, also very important to make sure they're tracking correctly. That just means as they say the word, I really want them to touch the word as they say it, it's really important. So make sure they're doing that. Um, now there's several components to this book goal. I want them to be reading with accuracy, fluency, and good comprehension. I'm gonna post a video later going more into detail about what I mean by those three things. So be on the lookout for that. Okay, one last thing before I go. Every Friday, I am going to be checking to see if the kiddos met their goals. So, I'm going to check their sight words, their counting, I'm going to listen to them read their book, and I'm going to get on to my teacher extra math dashboard to see who was able to log in this week. That's what the goal is for your fact fluency. Just get logged into extra math. If they have met their goals, they're gonna be rewarded during an award ceremony the following week. For example, if Jamie met her sight word goal when I asked her on Friday, the following week on Monday, we may be having our sight word award ceremony. So Jamie is gonna get 
a gold medal to wear around school during the day and a little tag on it that says Jamie met their sight word goal so anyone who sees her throughout the day can ask her about what she did at the end of the day I'm going to tear off the tag and stick it in a folder so they can take it home. I'm going to keep the medals because I can't buy new medals every week. And I can, I'm can i sure you can hear Moosey in the background. She's mad that there's some kids on the playground right now. Anyway, please let me know if you have any questions. I'm really excited to get started with these goals.